What is going on YouTube? I'm Brian here from Marsh Boys and we're coming at you with another installment of the decoy room. Today we're going to be talking snow goose decoys. So I just started this year kind of putting the snow goose spread together. Right now I'm at 10 dozen dive bomb you know tall silo socks. I have two dozen GHG silo socks and I have some full bodies. Now I don't know what numbers yet I'm going to play compared to full bodies and socks and wind socks, stuff like that. But I do know I want, you know, a good amount of full bodies. And with that, it's going to cost some money. So the two options right now that I'm looking at, and I already have some of each. Um, the first option that I'm thinking about going with is the GHG full bodies. This is the Harvester Pack. Um, right now I have a half a dozen of these and I have a dozen and a half of their blue geese because Rogers is having an incredible sale on them right now. Um, I really, really like these, but what I'm mainly looking at is the price point after the sale ends. You know, I'm looking to piece a dozen here, a dozen there, five dozen here, five dozen there together at a time. And $200 a half dozen is, you know, it, they're worth the money, don't get me wrong. It's just... Two hundred dollars a half dozen for snow goose decoys is is a lot when you're when you're trying to put twenty dozen on the ground, if you know what I mean. So, just a quick quick glance, hard body. It's got the motion stake cone in it. Very easy to set. It's got the hand loop on the back. You know, very good details. I really really like these decoys. But like I said, it's just I think for the price point, I'm going to be going with option number two. I'm going to show you here now, and this is kind of an unboxing video. Also, we still don't have a table. So I'm going to move our non-table out of the way. So here in front of me, I have the Final Approach Snow Goose Live full bodies. Right now on Rogers, I'm getting them for $120. They're on sale. Normally they're $125, and Rogers does offer, I believe, free shipping over $100, $99, whatever it is. For the price point, I don't think you can beat them. $120. It's, it's just a great price if you're going the full body route. Now, I know there's other companies like Jim Shoe Decoys, Flathead Decoys, and uh, Chicken Down Decoys, and Bulk Decoys, obviously, but a lot of them tend to sell out fast. You know, it's the same thing with, you know, another option of mine was going with the Avian X's because they were on a really, really good sale. But just like the GHGs, when they're not on sale anymore, you know, then you're paying $200 a half dozen. If you're somebody like me who's piecing a spread together over time, that's not really what you're looking for. Like I said, they're all great decoys. It's just I'm looking for what suits my budget. So, and these are going to be my first look just as much as your, your first look. So they come, you get six decoys per pack, obviously. You get two of these long neck feeders. You get two of the short neck feeders. I believe these are the long necks. And then you get two uprights. Um, tail loop for grabbing as many as you need to in the field. Uh, hard plastic design, just like the GHGs. I think, you know, at a first glance, I think they look just as good. And regular price, they're $70 cheaper. So we'll look at them side by side real quick. No matter whose decoy it is, that tail loop is a great idea because the you know trying trying ever. to carry like more than four big feet at a time. Maybe <laughs> maybe you fun. can get six if like you know one of them doesn't fall off. So first glance, the final approach decoys are bigger. Um, they're even a little more detailed. They don't have the foot pegs. I was gonna say that. You took too long to say it. I didn't know you were going right there. That was my comment originally, just for the record. <laughs> they don't have feet. Ryan doesn't like that they don't have feet. They don't I don't feet. care. Like I said, the GHGs are very, very nice decoys. It's just, I think for the price point, I'm just going to stick to the two dozen I do have. Um, now, I really, really like these final approaches. Um, I'm very glad I started picking these up. Uh, so that's the long neck feeder. Here is the universal motion stick. Uh, motion stakes they come with fiberglass stakes. Are they the edges. same? Are they the same as the other ones? Uh, yes. Yeah, so Actually, well, no, not those. Those are the GHG stakes. I have a half dozen of the Final Approach lesser full bodies that I use for my motion uh, that's where I saw spinners. Them um, 
Um, yeah, none of the exact same sticks. <laughs> so here is, yeah, this is going to be the short neck to this. Like I said, I think so. Yeah. Yeah. Like I said, it's just for one hundred twenty-five dollars. You know, like I said, on sale at one hundred twenty, which really doesn't make a whole lot of difference. These decoys are hard to beat. The cone underneath them, you could walk, have some guy setting stakes, and have somebody else just plopping decoys down. You don't need an expert to set these decoys. Um, all my Canada decoys are on bases, and I love bases for Canada hunting. But when you're, when I'm trying to fill a trailer with you know, 240 full bodies or 120 full bodies, whatever route I go, I don't want to deal with the bases. I just kind of want to chuck them in and go. And every review I've read on these, they, they, they can take the abuse. So you can just chuck these in your trailer and head on down the road. You don't have to worry about them getting scratched or anything like that. Uh, the details really, really nice on them, like I said earlier. So that's the, that's the short neck feeder. Uh, and this is going to be your upright. Yeah, same thing. Super nice decoy. Looks like a snow goose. Same size as a snow goose. Tail loop. Motion cone. I think Something this one's, rolling around on the inside. I think this one's been shot before. They're um, used? No, they're not used. Oh. No. Really, really nice decoys. So, if I had to rate them out of 10 for price point, obviously it's going to be a 10 out of 10. Um, detail, I'm going to have to go with a 8 out of 10. Um, usability, which would be how easy they are to set, pick up, stuff like that. I don't know that yet, but just looking, you know, relating them to my lesser, my lesser full bodies, I'm going to give them a 7 out of 10. I do like the stakes, um, but in frozen ground they can be a pain in the butt. I guess that would be the only downsides, and that's, I believe there's only three decoy companies that make full bodies on bases. Um, I know Tangle Free does, and I know Dakota does, so that might, that might only be the two. Um, so yeah, check them out, final approach. They don't sponsor us, I'm just doing this as a gear review here on the channel. What do you think, Goose? Um, hopefully by next season I will have a trailer full of these and we'll be getting after some snow geese with our good friend Riley from Delaware and whoever else decides to join us. So thank you for tuning in. Um, keep an eye on our, we don't really have a schedule yet. So like and subscribe, check out the other socials. Thank you.